Checky, check, 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 mic, check, mic, check. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, troops, wherever you are in the world, and welcome back to the channel, Mark. That's me, my words. As always, before I get into this quick video, please continue to hit that subscribe button down there. If you do enjoy the content, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Cheers, troops. Here we are, Sunday, 4th of December, 2022. Not a happy chap, troops. You could probably see why. Somebody's hit the van. They've hit the van, damaged it, and uh, disappeared. No details left, no nothing. So I parked the van up on Thursday, didn't use it Thursday afternoon, Thursday evening or Friday. Went to jump in yesterday to go on a little trip and yeah, was greeted with a broken mirror, uh, mirror, a broken mirror and scratch paint. So, you know, this is where I park. You can see like, I'm not exactly sticking out. That's exactly how I left it on Thursday. So here's the main road. Here's where I've parked. You can see the gap. Plenty, like nobody's come past and clipped it in a car, that's for sure. Um, which leads me to believe either somebody's kicked it off on purpose <clears throat> or I think what I think has happened is a cyclist has hit it or somebody on one of the one of these e-scooters because I see people bombing up and down this road in this little gap here on those electric scooters. So maybe somebody's been had a drink, I don't know, not seen the van, how you can't see it, I, I'm not so sure. Um, but I think um, somebody's clipped it from a, a bicycle or an electric scooter or something like that. The reason I say that is because when I look at the scratch marks, if I just go back a picture or two, so here, this crease in the door, which is natural, that's part of the body lines, that scratch is here, right on this crease. So if I just... Go to where the, you can see it, look. It's right on there. And actually, I'm a cyclist. If you follow my channel, you know that I go out cycling. And when I do the measurements, that is about the height of handlebars for a bike or a scooter. And I think that's what's happened. I think somebody has been bombing up the road here, either on an electric scooter or a bike. For some reason, maybe there was traffic coming here fast and they've, wobbled in and they've hit my mirror and snapped it and then just ridden off. Um, but they've actually, you know, they've gone right into the side of the van because they've scratched it. So they haven't just clipped the mirror. They've literally, they must have fallen onto the van. Um, that's what I'm seeing anyway. So the police have been out. They, they, you know, they took some pictures. Um, there's no cameras around there, apparently. This building here uh, is a school. So they said that they'll check if they've got any cameras. Uh, they'll check the other buildings across the road, but they don't think there's any cameras covering this part of this part of town, which is bad because if I'd parked it here, there's cameras up here that would have seen what happened. But there's no space up there. My my flat is literally opposite side of the road to where this car is. So, you know, I, I try to park there as often as possible so I can keep an eye on it. Um, but yeah, so I filled out the insurance claim form. Um, they're going to get back to me. I've done it all online. So, you know, I'm just going to have to wait and see what they say, troops. Hopefully it's covered. I did uh, think about sending this to Marek, who's the detailer that I use to see if it could be polished out. But it's so deep, like it's gone right into the primer. So it needs respraying for sure. Um, so I'm just hoping it's covered by insurance because if it isn't, you know, I'm going to have to pay out of pocket. Um, and even if it is, you know, does that mean I'm going to end up with a a bloody excess premium next year for something that is not my fault, you know? Anyway, that's it, troops. Just wanted to share that with you. So I'll update you on the progress on this. It'll be a bit, a bit of uh, content for the channel, won't it? Um, but for the time being, it's held on with parcel tape. You've, you've all seen it. You know, I'm not the first person to have a wing mirror clipped. It's just taped on at the moment. So I'm hoping it lasts. Um, until I can get it into the, the garage. They did say on the insurance, they give you a an option because they know you when you put all, it's very clever, when you put all your details in online, it brings up your policy and then it brings up their list of approved uh, repair centers. And one of them is the place where I bought the van from. So I've chosen that because they, you know, they know me, I take it there for servicing and all that sort of stuff. They know that the paintwork's been coated, so they'll have to be careful you know, with that, I'll have to take that into consideration if they're going to repair it. So, you know, it's going to be a trip over to them, see what they say, see how long it's going to take. 
you know, see if there's an excess that I have to pay or if it's even covered at all. If it isn't covered, I'm going to go the route of fixing this myself, buying the part that's broken, fixing that myself, and then getting Marek to, to touch up the scratch, which won't be ideal. But, you know, can I afford to take, take this door off and have it resprayed? I don't know. It depends how much it would cost. I'd have to, I'd have to look into it and see. Um, but it's the inconvenience as well, you know. It's like, oh, man, now I'm going to be stuck with a mirror, wondering if it's going to come untaped as I'm doing 120 kilometers an hour down the motorway. Anyway, troops, that's it. That's my Sunday. So <laughs> I'm going to get ready now for the football. England are playing tonight, playing Senegal in the last 16 of the World Cup. So really looking forward to that. Um, the game before that is Poland-France. Uh, and the winners of those two games will play each other in the quarterfinals. So all to play for. Interesting day. Uh, and I'm going to go away and watch a load more YouTube videos on how to fix this in case that's what comes about. Anyway, troops, that's it. Uh, just a bit of a, a Sunday video, something that's happened to the van, share that with you. Uh, I do hope you're enjoying your Sunday. As always, troops, wherever you are in the world, do take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, troops.